Well, the Salem High School football team has overcome countless obstacles this season in order to make it to the state championship this weekend. But for one player, it's been a little more difficult than most. 10 News reporter Jessica Jewell brings us the story of one Spartan who's beating the odds on and off the field. Brad Michigan is busy getting ready for the state championship this weekend. The ultimate goal for any high school football player. But getting to this point has been a little more difficult for him than most. I've been in dev since my whole life. We first introduced you to Brad back in 2002 when he was three years old and had just received his cochlear implant. But that's not the only obstacle Brad has faced. He's also a type 1 diabetic. We've always tried to push him to do what he wanted to do, to go out there and act like a normal kid and do those things. And, you know, there's been challenges, but he wanted to do it and, and he did it. And, uh, and we figured out, you know, a way to work around those setbacks. His dad says one of those setbacks was figuring out how to fit the cochlear implant under his helmet. It's basically held on by some toupee tape. And when he gets sweaty or gets hit hard, it'll knock that loose. Sometimes I get hit, I just put it right back on. Square him up now. In the huddle under the Friday night lights, Brad says it can be difficult to hear, but he's trained himself to make sure he never skips a beat. Just got to look at the, um, the coaches, the players, look at the words. I mostly look at their lips. Coach Magenbauer says they've made adjustments too, but they treat him just like everyone else. If he does something great, we're going to praise him. If he does something bad, we're going to get all over him. He says Brad sets an example the whole team can learn from. I'm just so proud of him from the standpoint that he, you know, he, he doesn't make any excuse for himself whatsoever and he never would. He's part of the solution, part of the team that, that helps him win and not a problem. Brad wants one more win though, the state championship, but it's about much more than just a game. I'm thankful for on the football team. I'm thankful I can play and I can hear. In Salem, Jessica Jewell, 10 News, working for you.